A Nina family has faced two tragedies in just about one month's time, but they are holding out hope for the future. They shared their story with Olivia Acre. When it rains, it pours. That's how the Van Stippens described the last few months of their life. On September 2nd, 13-year-old Chance came home from school sick. Every day he was complaining of a headache and then he was sleeping nonstop and then it was the nausea and vomiting but there was never a fever involved. On September 22nd, Chance received an MRI. I knew right away that something more serious was going on. Things progressed quickly after that. His doctor broke the news that they had found a four inch in diameter tumor in his brain. From a nausea spell to brain cancer in just a few short weeks, just when the Van Stippens thought they couldn't handle any more Tragedy struck again. Earlier this week, the family lost their home to a fire. So all you could see was the flames and then very thick black smoke. In a matter of weeks, the family's entire world has been turned upside down, twice. Just the cancer enough was a lot to balance and then the fire on top of it. But the Van Stippens are not going to give up. All of us are very appreciative of all the donations, the support, the prayers, the thoughts. And the outpour of support they've received over the last few weeks has changed something in these parents. Once we are in the position to give back, we are going to be giving back for the rest of our lives because of the support we've gotten. But getting them through these tragedies the most? The strength shown by their son Chance. You're stronger than I could ever be. After Chance's most recent surgery, things started to look up. Chance wanted to resume an old hobby video games. Oh, it was the best thing ever. I was like, I absolutely will play video games with you. I hate video games, but I was like, oh my God, you want to play a video game? I'm on it. With more battles ahead, they are holding out hope for their chance to get through this. In Nina, Olivia Acre, NBC 26.